All right, I know uh, we, we recently had a conversation about um, looking forward to doing some things at Chuckles and um, just just what what do you what do you see as something that you want to do in the near future with Chuckles back home in Memphis? Uh, Memphis is on the rise, man. Memphis is a hotbed for comedy and they don't even, they sit in it and they don't know. You yeah. know what I mean? That's why it's, it's up to us to go ahead and flip it. And uh, I'm, I'm coming to take over Memphis. It's, yeah. a, it's a little island, it's a little set, like, Let's go. I mean, so, we got the king of rap, the king of rock, the king of pop, man. Yeah. The kings of the king of the kings of Memphis comedy, because that's what the Camigos are. But myself, yeah. I'm, I'm in God mode right now. Yeah. So anything, anytime I get on stage, the whole room gonna remember. So do y'all do you see do you see yourselves hosting? Hosting, ho hosting the chuckles. Yeah, I think yeah. that would be smart. And I ain't trying to tell nobody how to run their business. But I told you, I'm gonna keep it. About 87% all the time. Because 100 niggas, like, I keep 100, you a lying ass nigga. You automatically <laughs> lose a point for lying to say you keep it 100. So I try to keep it 87, 87%. Gracias. James Brown shit. James, James Brown shit. James Brown shit. But at the end of the day, yeah, Chuckles, if they want, if they want to have their whole hopping and jumping every single day, even on the, 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 the light days, and comedians know the light days, Wednesdays and Thursdays, man, yeah. Let's make Put it us manifest, on this stage. Let's, Let's make it manifest.